Hi judges, we are a team from the next day. I am the team leader, Corwin Ho, and these are my members, Minzo and Adu. The reason why we are partaking in this year's YC competition is because of this year's team, Everyday Superheroes. So, we believe that the deaf community are actually everyday heroes in our daily lives. This is because despite their problem of hearing and their difficulty in daily conversations, they still insist on coming to work and also contribute to the society. Which is why, today, we would like to pitch our project Smart glasses. From our research, as you can see from this graph, by the year 2050, the number of people with disabling hearing loss will be increasing rapidly. From our research, we also found out that 80% of these individuals who suffer from hearing impairment actually live in low and middle income countries. So here is our reliable and cost-effective solution to this problem. So as you can see, the built-in microphone on our smart glasses will capture the spoken words. After that, using our speech to text AI technology, we will convert the spoken words into readable text. Lastly, the text is displayed onto our glasses using holographic technique and our user will only have to read the text. Budget for our glasses are set below 100 Malaysian ringgit, making it affordable for most families. For starters, our device can be easily attached to any existing eyewear and is capable of converting speech into text. We will then display it to our user using a holographic technique to project the words from our OLED onto the glasses. To this day, our smart glasses support English, Malay, Chinese, and other languages too. In the future, we will include the usage of AI using each impulse. Realistically speaking, smart glasses may just be the breakthrough of AR glasses in Malaysia. Salam sejahtera. Salam sejahtera. Saya dari Malaysia. Saya juga dari Malaysia. How are you? I'm fine. What is your name? Minzong. Ni hao ma? Wo hen hao. Ni jing nian ji sui. Wo jing nian si liu sui. Hi, how are you? Weather. This is the function for battery charging indicator. On the other hand, there are no laws in Malaysia prohibiting the use of AR glasses. Upon designing the prototype of our smart glasses, we implemented waterproof casing. We make sure that there are no exposed wires and also implement eye protection. Which is why it is actually very safe and there are no high risks for our user when wearing our product. As mentioned, one of the SDGs that we target for this project is quality education. So, when using our smart glasses, people with hearing impairment are also able to understand what their teachers are teaching. This exposes them to STEM education. So, even deaf people can have the chance to learn STEM education, which is why STEM education will be popularized.